Dragon Ball Super is returning. Shocker, right? No, I'm sure all of you watching this right now knew that it was always the case. But what we now have is a release date, information what the first few arts will be about, and how this series will differ from the last. For all that and more, watch this video through to the end. Right, so first things first, the alleged release date is July 2019. Yes, not 2020, July this year in less than four months time. But just know this information is unconfirmed and no official announcement has been made. But instead, Geekdom 101, who's often affiliated with much of Funimation's cast, is the one who's releasing this information. So make what you want of that, but you guys would know from my past videos, Dragon Ball Super has been having news of its return confirmed for literal months, from licenses for episodes being publicly sold to Italian voice actors from the cast accidentally confirming the fact Dragon Ball Super has been in production for a while now. In fact, it's been in production since October 2018, meaning just six months after the original series ended and only two months before Broly was released. Now that probably brings up the question in your mind, okay Arj, so what are they going to do with the art style? Clearly in Dragon Ball Super Broly, the art style was different, all thanks to the designs of Shintani. Well, allegedly Shintani is definitely returning to the main series now, and the art style will follow on from what we saw in Dragon Ball Super Broly, which to be honest is not really surprising and is something we all knew was going to happen for the sake of consistency. Now, what about the first few episodes and storylines? Well, we know for a fact as this information was actually released over a year ago, that when Dragon Ball Super eventually did return, it would begin following the story of the manga and Toyotaro rather than the manga following the anime as it did previously. However, this does not necessarily mean they will be one to one the same as we know the manga did make some changes and alterations and that is likely to remain the case again for consistency as ironic as that sounds. But also to ensure the anime continues to have the hype from spoilers and everything that you had last series. And don't forget all the filler episodes we're most likely gonna get. Now, I'm excited even though this is unconfirmed as we've been thinking for a while now that in April, yes, next month during the Dragon Ball 30th anniversary, we would get this announcement. So in effect, Christmas has kind of come early and now you have some idea of what will be happening, but still four months? That is so soon, I can't really even believe it until I see it, but let me know in the comments what you're thinking right now. My normal fan manga star videos will be continuing tomorrow though, and I've got something interesting involving the son of Broly. So subscribe and stay tuned for that, but yeah, that's all the information I have. Until next video guys, cheers.